Hello, good YouTubers of the world, all about that is back with another video. How are you guys doing today? I'm not too bad. I'm at the end of two lovely days off. I've had some lovely lions. I have definitely recharged the battery. Um, but enough of that. Today's video is has been, actually, it has been requested by quite a few people. Um, an updated version of my accessories collection, Supreme accessories collection um so you know why not do it you know we're in the off season you guys who are new to my channel might not have seen my full collection i think the last time i did yeah the last time i did my supreme accessories video was probably maybe three to four months ago so you know i've obviously got four winter 18 accessories now in there some older pieces so yeah let's let's get into it let's show you guys all my lovely stuff now before i do i will say to you new subscribers i had a older stuff um but i had to in the last sort of eight years roughly i had to get rid of a lot of my og stuff i am getting the odd bit back here and there um but yeah i had to get rid of it Due to financial reasons, um, you know, we're talking about items that I had from 1996 onwards. And yeah, I know, I know. I can hear you all groan out there. And yes, I groan, believe me, I groan daily regarding the loss of my OG collection. So, a lot of this is probably newer stuff from, let's think, probably maybe like four or five years ago-ish. Some of it earlier um but anyway it is what it is <coughs> excuse me we will get into that in just a second if you're new to my channel please subscribe like comment and share let's get to 1000 subs because i do want to do this giveaway now that actually brings me nicely onto the first few pieces that i'm going to show you the first piece being this will be leaving my collection once we get to 1000 subs it is the phone booth keyring and I'll be giving this amongst a load of stickers, Supreme, All About Nat stickers and skate stickers. You guys will be getting um, this little bundle once we reach 1000 subs. And I am also going to throw in a Supreme London business card as well. So that will be being thrown in to one of you guys. The next pieces are, are the poor cactus, the cactus key ring. This poor little thing is now officially dead. So I did water it, but I just don't think it had a, a very big lifespan, considering the roots aren't going to be exactly very deep in there. But it's still a nice piece, and I'm still glad to own it. Yeah, I do like the cactus keychain. I wouldn't actually um, encourage anyone to buy one resell because, in all honesty, you're probably going to get a shriveled up cactus. They were all very nice when they first released, but if you got it on resell, yeah, I don't think it's going to look too good. We have two spirit levels. The red and the yellow once again i love these pieces really nice piece i would highly encourage any of you guys to get this if you can get it for a decent price definitely this is probably a highlight of my collection i love these pieces these are the slugger pieces from oh, i don't want to say it was it 2000 and Seven. I've got a feeling it was 2007 these came out but beautiful I love these pieces these are ones that I couldn't bear to uh, let go in all honesty so those are the key rings in my collection I think those are all the key rings yes okay so where shall we go next I'll go with this actually this is where I put my rings my work name badge, 
my fob for work just a little nice uh, OG <laughs> Stuss, I know this is a spring but this is an OG Stussy keychain I love this it's great that's from back in the day as well early 2000s love that um, and obviously I keep my watch and everything but I'll take this off and you can see the design of what I'm talking about this is the pill tray really nice piece I love the way it's got supreme on the pills <clears throat> so that is the tray when did that come out don't know a couple of years back uh, I won't try and guess because yeah it could be a long video if I did so the next piece is the public enemy undercover pouch nice little piece oh, love that I just loved that collaboration on the whole that co collaboration was so underrated and obviously it comes like that so you can wear it around your neck yeah it's not I wouldn't say it was the most amazing quality but it is a really nice piece and I am glad that I got it if we here we have the sog um tool shovel thing i won't bother getting it out because i'm pretty sure you've seen it all before uh, which was nice because you got it in a little case you did get it in a nice little case um but yeah the folding shovel oh <laughs> let's get this one the good old catches mask this piece you can still get for a decent price actually um but i had to get it to go with the other items that i'm going to show you which you've probably seen if you've seen my video with my mum if you watch that video you will know what i'm talking about um but this is great i think the details on this piece are so nice so you've got your supreme going through there printed on you've got your rawlings patch there um you've got supreme on the back of the strap you've also got it at the top there it's just a really nice underrated piece in my opinion yes of course i don't play bloody baseball but i just think this is such a nice piece to have in the collection um and the next piece we have is the lock box really nice piece again and inside the lock box we have a few things that i'm going to show you so we have inside the lock box we have a fair few poppy seeds another pack i do intend to try to grow a plant and grow this spring my last lot got eaten by slugs I was a bit annoyed by that i felt like saying to them do you know what you're eating do you do you really that's worth a lot of money but they didn't listen so anyway um so we have some incense matches oh yes they smell lovely smell very cinnamony we have a toothbrush and and may i say these two items i actually bought these were free gifts but i ended up having to buy them because i got neither in my packages then we have the small box i really want the large one as well actually looking for the large one um, which is nice because on the bottom you've got it embossed Supreme New York and all that and inside this I have all my backs to my pins that are down there all my backs and inside this we also have we have some more backs there we also have this little stash keychain thing so you can see there oh there's nothing there is there oh but there is oh but there is comes off and you can stash your little tablets in there or whatever you want to do um and then you also have this keychain which i really like again little goes on your keys it's a bottle opener screwdriver type thingamajig and then I've got a couple of pins, the um, 
Fuck the President, and then MLK. And here you have the Paris business card. We have a London business card. And we have another Paris business card, got two of those. And we have a Shibuya Japan business card and the Metro card. The last piece in here, I'm going to really try my best to get this out now, is the um, Swiss Army knife. And, I, and if um, leaks are true, they're bringing another one out, which I don't really understand, to be honest with you. It's like the um, folding chairs. They're bringing those out again, which I don't really understand. It's so difficult to get this out of here. Mm. Oh, I can't get it out. I'm going to have to leave it. But anyway, you know what a Swiss Army life knife looks like. This... We were sold these. In the UK, they sold these. Something has changed between 2015 and 2018 or 17. Something changed. But at that time, in the UK, they sold the pen knives. I don't know what happened. But anyway, so let's get on to decks. I haven't got a massive deck collection, to be honest with you. Not anymore, anyway. Um... So, this is the Pope Antihero deck. I love this graphic, really like it. It very much reminds me of the Sex Pistols type uh, graphics. You probably know the last two. Obviously, I've got the Marvin Gaye deck, the Lee Quinona's deck, which, again, I really like. I think it's very underrated. I'm pretty sure you will know this one. If you are subscribed to my channel, if you're not subscribed, then you really need to subscribe. That's what. Um, yeah. The Sulphur TNF Purple Backpack. Love it, love it. So that is the backpack. And then this I've had. Oh, look at that reflection there. This I've had since 15, 14, 13, I don't know. Um, and it's in great condition because I look after my stuff. Um, I was tempted to sell it, but then I realised actually no, I want to keep my older stuff, to be honest with you. I'd rather keep my older bags and then sell the new ones. I did have the tan bag from recently, but ended up selling that. Um, yeah, I was going to sell this one, but I know I prefer this to the recent ones that they've been doing. Um, and then let's get into the toolbox. So as you can see, I have the toolbox. This is an amazing piece. Now in the toolbox was about 8 to 10. can't remember exactly the numbers, but about 8 to 10 bouncy balls. Well, I managed to get the right size jar. I've been looking at getting a jar. Hey, up it's snowing. Hooray! Go to sleep. Um, so I have some of my bounty balls in this jar. And doesn't it look wonderful? I really like this. So I think I'm gonna leave the majority of them in here and then I might put another one in a little box because you can get clear perspex boxes that go that are like for golf balls i might put one in there the other thing i have in here is the luden's cough drops um and then the two gross pins black and the yeah white is it no natural and then this oh such an underrated piece so underrated so the Supreme Nike earring or stud or whatever you want to call it. Really nice. And then on the back, it's got Supreme. Very, very tiny. It's got the Supreme box logo on the back of that. 
Okay, and then inside we have the thermos. This is just brilliant. Spoon, if I can undo it. Has Supreme engraved on it. Love that. Then, quite a recent one is the Supreme North Face Compass. So the next one, and I have two of these, is the Pack Light. I've got a dead stock item, dead stock one, and one that I've had to let down a bit to go in. But this is brilliant. Such a great piece. Look at that. Can I turn it down a bit? There we go. Oh, isn't that lovely? Again super underrated piece look at it flashing um and that's lasted i've not i've not even charged that up that has lasted quite a while as it is the recent ones another couple of recent ones with the help from my friends as they say uh the black and the red markers shout out to tina and marie for helping me get these um Stupidly in the UK, we didn't get the markers. Hmm. But we got American football gloves instead. What? Anyway, enough of that. We have one of my favourite pieces, the baseball. And as I say, you will know that I have this because you will have watched my Guess How Much My Items Are Worth with my mum. If you haven't watched that video, go watch it. It's brilliant. It's really funny. So the baseball and then we have the Hysteric Glamour, once again and a really massively underrated collaboration. Hysteric Glamour, a brilliant, such a great brand. The mug, love this mug. As you can see behind me, I've got the anatomy figures and I'm sure you've seen those a million times. Do, 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 do. I look like Mary Poppins then, didn't I? Getting the, <laughs> the umbrella out of the bag and the, uh, the hat stand. Anyway, yes. Back to this beautiful piece. Oh, I love this piece. Hmm. Yes, very nice. Um, okay, so as you saw from the video the other day, this is the mini baseball bat. And once again, a very, very sought after piece that goes with my catcher's mask and my baseball. This isn't exactly a piece, but I made it into a piece. I, I emptied the packet out before the actual stains started to come through flattened it down and I have a really nice framed picture so that was a cool piece I have Cherry and I have Blessed both amazing DVDs that come with little booklets really nice pieces um, I also have uh, you will have seen it the Thrasher magazine that came with the Blessed poster public enemy poster but I will probably go through um, a sticker collection and a pin collection video probably at the end of next season um, to give you an updated version of those including posters and stuff like that um, and then the Paris when they open the Paris store the zine as they call it um, and then the Bible basically the Supreme Bible Bible the Supreme Bible um, and obviously this is the Rizzoli book that they brought out a, uh, a black box logo as well for great book though if you haven't got it go get it you can get it off Amazon and have got it I think um, it's a good book really good book and if and if you want to know more about the brand and you want to get to know the brand get that book it's ace uh, so, I think that is actually it. 
And if I have forgotten something, I will show you on my next video. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe if you're not already because I really want to give away some good stuff to my lovely, lovely subscribers. So please get hitting that subscribe button and all about that. We'll see you on the next one. Keep it real, guys.